Sup guys, Dino Fries here, and welcome back to the Spell Brigade Early Access. This is a Survivor's Like by Bolt Blaster Games. Shout out to the devs for sending me a code. Show you guys this for the third time. Uh, we are gonna conquer the. Well, first of all, I unlocked Ludwig and Cavan. We're gonna go with Ludwig, and we're gonna conquer the Frozen Agents this time. Uh, I beat the Verdant Meadows already. I showed you guys that in the last video on this game. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and take on the fire level next. But let's go ahead and beat the ice level. So I have a strategy now. Um, my strategy is only get the good spells. That's my whole strategy. <laughs> I also, I've been grinding a bit. I got a few more meta upgrades. And uh, yeah, you, you, let, me, let me show you what I'm made of now. Also, I've realized the strategy is to just level up your spells as much as possible. Another thing, uh, I would play the Sun Mage if I really wanted to pop off, but I kind of just wanted to pick a different character just to show you guys. Um, we're going to pick the Sun Mage though for the, for the fire level in the next video because I, I, I need all the power I can get for that stage because that stage is actually freaking hard. Oh my gosh, dude, I am popping off already with these these upgrades. So my plan is basically, um, the reason I chose Ludwig is because I like the sword. Um, we want to get the Sun Mage's spell, which is like garlic. And really anything that just like is a close range spell. So there we go. Starting off strong. Yeah, so in the other video on the Verdant Meadows, I went like all range. And as fun as that was, uh, it's more difficult and I've, I've found. It's nice to have spells that are close range because then you know what enemies you're killing. You can kind of direct your attacks better, uh, cooldown. And you could pick up the experience points better instead of like range attacks where uh, sh shit gets crazy and, and then too all over the place. So I find this to be the move, at least for me. Also, we want to prioritize, um, I would say cooldown first, size second, and like damage third. And we, we, we want to get like our main spell to 10 as soon as possible, I found. I, I think elements, like infusing your weapons, your spells with elements is super important. And when it comes to infusions, I also have a strategy with which elements work best. Also, I could reroll. Remember how I said, like, I don't know if I could reroll? So this is good. Um, spell rotates more slowly, but it's greatly increased in size. That's good. Yeah, so basically, I found, at least with these close range spells, um, size, is that, is that ice is actually the best, so that they, so that all these enemies are coming at you and they get slowed down as they approach, and so, and so like, eventually, like, let's say I just stand still, I don't, I'm not gonna do that now, but if I have ice on, like, I don't even have to move, like they just come into my circle and die slowly. Um, we're gonna do size. There's also other things I've learned, which will probably come across when I get certain like augmentations and things like that. Um, but yeah, ice, ice and lightning I found, I found uh, are where it's at. If I don't get ice or lightning, that sucks. Um, I think I would go fire and then acid. I find acid to be kind of just terrible. 
Also, I found out that acid is supposed to make the enemy vulnerable and take more damage. So, like, not like poison. I think burn, like the fire burns them and does damage over time. Acid's supposed to make them take more damage, but I haven't seen that pay off for me yet. Maybe I'm misguided though. Cool down. I've been playing this game like all day, by the way. Not all day, but like I've been, I played a bit today. It's fun. For like the umpteenth time, this game is fun. Also, it's uh, verified on Steam Deck. I played it even before it was verified and it ran fine, but... Solid Steam Deck game. Solid Steam Deck game. Sorry. Oopsie, my controller went fritzy. Um, spill cooldown. Ice, ice, ice. Yes! Okay, we're doing good so far. Everything is going according to plan. Scoop! Spell cooldown. I th that's another thing. Oh, armor by 50 is actually huge. <sighs> I'm gonna take that. That was a hard choice, but I also find that certain like legendary upgrades you have to go with. I'm always trying to level up my spells, but if there's like an epic or a legendary upgrade that is always good, like armor, um, I'm gonna go for that. And really, you know, like, you you don't want to, like, you don't want to take a minute to do, like, you have to just keep grinding. Unless there's an objective up, just grind. Like, keep getting experience points. Be efficient. Min-max. Um, I would either go with orbs or phantom blades. I think I'm going to go with phantom blades because I just think they're better. And they're close range enough to be okay, like with my build. Let's slaughter this crab real quick. See, you see how good that ice is? That's what I'm saying. Okay, let's go back. Uh, your spell rotates more slowly. Wait, I can make this even bigger? I hope that, I hope I didn't waste that. I think that should have just made it better, because that's a pretty big sword. Um, spell damage, I gotta go with the, yeah, I gotta go with the epic. That's what I mean by like a, like a prioritizing, you know, cooldown size and then damage, but if it's a rare upgrade, if it's an epic upgrade, I'm just gonna go for it. Because it's usually worth it. Oof. Luck by 8 is crazy. I'm still early in the game, too. I'm going with it. Nice. 
Uh, size. I'm not gonna go with a rare upgrade. Even the movement speed is super important. Oh, health? I don't think I need health. Let's just go cool down and get this element. Please be ice. We'll just go fire. I could still get ice on the swords at level... Um, I don't know what it is, 12? Let's cool down. I don't need regeneration. Don't need to regenerate health if I can't even get hit. Yeah, I, uh, I really only have to, like, kind of, like, move around, like, kind of just, like, kite them, and watch out for those range, those orange goo balls. So I want to try to get the augmentation with those, um, with the phantom blades. Where they shoot out in both directions, front and back. So that, because like mostly I'm like running away from enemies like this, so I want them to shoot behind me for sure. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. We get that, I'm gonna go look for, um, Actually, only wait for the objective, because a relic probably spawned on the map at this point. And I want to get that. Oh, fudge. Gotta go for it. That might help a lot, actually. It's hard because, like, you can't max everything. You can't, like, max every spell. And, like, I really want to. But, uh, it's okay. See, this is bad. This is really bad. So, Rocky Road is ass. It's so bad. Ugh, I might go Moon Meringue. Uh, I don't know. Moon Meringue. I just don't like Rocky Road. I didn't want that, by the way. Like, I just did not want that. And now we're stuck with it. <laughs> Cooldown always worth it. Let's get this magnet. Okay, I'll start walking around now. Because an objective's gonna drop soon. We'll go. Cooldown. There we go. So I'll look for the rip. The rift, the relic on the way. Some of the objectives are a lot harder than the others. I find the statue one to be particularly annoying. Oh, there's a relic. I wish you could reroll spells. But I guess that's the problem with them, where there being too few in the game. Your spell increases in size over time, extending its reach. Maybe. This would be good for getting hit. Let's just go big damage. Okay, I need to get this one. Dude, this one's crazy, because look at this. I have I have 134 armor. That's a 134% increase in damage. That's nuts. 
I wonder if they'll nerf that, because it just seems like a really easy way. I always get that relic off for me too, and I could reroll if I didn't get it, I think. Um, damage, cooldown. Let's go ahead and do... I want to get this to max level as soon as possible, because it's my best spell right now and I also want to get that sword to max level too because I've really put a lot of I put a lot of uh invest in, I invested a lot into that sword. We're doing good though. Okay, 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 okay. I don't really care about spell range. I guess I could have re-rolled that now that I think about it. Did I have re-rolls? Some, sometimes you could re-roll in exchange for health. Other times you need to get like a meta upgrade to be able to re-roll stuff. Which I don't have any of. Um, we gotta go straight into this. Another thing is cool with this build is that I can stand like right here. And just like go off. Uh oh. Except when that happens. Perfect. Absolutely perfect, yes. I'm getting those sweet offers though because of how high my luck is right now. I have three swords out at, at, at a time now. That's crazy. Oh my goodness. You're witnessing greatness right now, guys. Oh my gosh, I have to go for this. That's a cooldown on every all my spells. <sighs> Let's go. Please be ice. Now we're cooking. We've been cooking, actually. Don't want to upgrade that anymore. My next objective is to get that fire sword max level. The cool thing about armor is that I think I completely negate damage on those those orange goo balls actually. Here, fire one at me guys, let me check. Somebody shoot. Look how big those swords are. That's crazy. Yeah, I can't reroll spells. Um, spell damage, I'm just gonna, whatever it is, I'm gonna take it. I just really wanted to get that sword maxed out. With two spells max level like that, I'm golden. Cooldown. I might have took, maybe I should have took base damage, but it's fine. Yeah, you saw that goo ball hit me. I didn't take any damage. Almost there. Piece of cake. Let's get it. I don't care about crit chance. <sighs> oh man, I'll go. I'll go. <sighs> Pardon me. Wants to go. No, I gotta go. Plasma. Lightning is good too because lightning increases your mobbing potential. Which is important when there's like a pack following you. And because I'm close range, it'll like seep through them. And I have to go for that. I'm pretty good now with like just my two levels, my, uh, my two spells at max level. More XP, you gain 100 health. That's pretty good. Your armor is increased by 10 each time. That means my uh, damage will go up. So I will take that. Even though I only have one more objective, I think.
Let's look at that crab. Let's get Moonmarang leveled up. Hopefully get ice. Is ice even worth it for this? Probably go for fire. I would have got lightened if it gave me it. I destroyed that crab. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad for that crab. Your spell deals critical. No, your spell. This is what I wanted. You take less damage. I'm not gonna take damage. Okay, that's good. Now I just gotta get my phantom blades. I just gotta get. An, I gotta get an element in them. That's what I need right now. Don't need pickup distance. I would love to re-roll this. But. Could have went for movement speed, I guess, but it's okay. Oh, man. I'm about to go crazy. I just want those level ups, man. Bruh. Give me something. I'm OP right now. I feel like I can just walk through them. Damn, I really, I'm really trying to get this uh, Phantom Blades leveled up, but it just doesn't want me to. They really don't want me to. Bruh. How can I deny that? Are you kidding me? Bigger swords? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get the max level Moonmarine. Yeah, I just want to try to get an, any any element on that. Preferably, uh, I don't know. I guess lightning. Anything but acid, really. Oh my gosh! So many explodies. I think my armor is just too freaking high right now that I'm just kind of like, even when I get hit, it's either like negated damage completely or just like a little little scratch. Um, increased general spell size by ten, I guess. I can't believe how big those swords are. That's crazy. I've never seen them get that big. Give me Phantom Blades, please. Oh, I should have got Moon Meringue. Oh, that was stupid. That was stupid. I'll get Moon Meringue now. No, I won't. I'm level 59. I don't think I've ever got this high of a level. Ice or lightning, please. I am so OP right now. I'm gonna slaughter the, the boss. Yes! 
Play it then. What if I just stood here? Twenty-one damage from the explosion. That's nuts. Let's keep going into Phantom Blades. That would be crazy if I max out every spell. It's never been done before. In the history of this game, it's never been done before. I would, I would be setting a world record if I accomplished this. I'm not even going to look at it. Almost there. Uh oh, here he is. Easiest game ever. I'm so good at this game. I didn't even die once. Didn't even die once. That's crazy. I told you guys I could do it. I told you. What did I say? What did I say? And there you have it. That was the Frozen Ancients. Uh, we got one more while to go. Check, look out for my next video. Thank you guys for watching. Drop a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below. Are you playing this game? Am I the only one out here playing this game? Uh, it's super fun. I recommend it. And yeah, uh, thanks for watching again. Appreciate you. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.